He didn't even condemn the people who came out of the fields in Charlottesville, their veins bulging, carrying Nazi flags. I'm not talking about the neo-Nazis and the white nationalists, because they should be condemned totally. He hadn't even condemned the Ku Klux Klan yet. Racism is evil, and those who cause violence in its name are criminals and thugs, including the KKK, neo-Nazis, white supremacists, and other hate groups that are repugnant to everything we hold dear as Americans. When has he spoken up about peace and unity? America desperately needs unity, and it needs the spirit of togetherness. I stand before you as a friend and ally to every American seeking justice and peace. Healing, not hatred, justice, not chaos, are the mission at hand. Now is the time to find the courage to answer hatred with unity, devotion, and love. He said nothing about the pandemic. Do you hear him talk about it at all? Many Americans, including me, have sadly lost friends and cherished loved ones to this horrible disease. As one nation, we mourn, we grieve, and we hold in our hearts forever the memories of all of those lives that have been so tragically taken so unnecessary. In their honor, we will unite. In their memory, we will overcome. And when the China virus hit, we launched the largest national mobilization since World War II. Invoking the Defense Production Act, we produced the world's largest supply of ventilators. We shipped hundreds of millions of masks, gloves, and gowns to our frontline healthcare workers. To protect our nation's seniors, we rushed supplies, testing kits, and personal to nursing homes. We gave everything you can possibly give, and we're still giving it because we're taking care of our senior citizens. We developed a wide array of effective treatments, including a powerful antibody treatment known as convalescent plasma that will save thousands and thousands of lives. Most importantly, we are marshalling America's scientific genius to produce a vaccine in record time. We will have a safe and effective vaccine this year, and together we will crush the virus.